paano ako nakita ng uh, from $100 to $200 in a day ng nasa bahay lang. Jessie and welcome to my new channel. Actually, this is my second channel. So if you are new here, welcome. This channel is going to be more about trading, not only for the stock market but also for other um, traded exchanges as well. Ang una natin pag-usapan ay cryptocurrency. Ano nga ba ang cryptocurrency? Um, paano natin tinatrade to? And saan ba to nagsimula? Paano ako nakita ng uh, from $100 to $200 in a day ng nasa bahay lang. If you are ready, then let's get on to it. Pero bago tayo magsimula, um, disclaimer lamang po, hindi po ako financial advisor. Ito ay basa sa aking experience and learning. I have been studying on how to trade since 2017 and ngayon na practice ko na siya. So, paano nga ba ang cryptocurrency? So, ang name ng cryptocurrency ay galing sa salitang cryptography and currency. Sa cryptography kasi, we use advanced math to secure our funds. So, ang cryptocurrency ay isang form of a digital cash. So, ang ibig sabihin nito ay pwede tayong mag mag um, buy ng groceries using using digital form of money or uh, to book flights to book hotels and other stuff. So, kung sasabihin nyo na para tong PayPal or para tong uh, bank transfer, money po yun. Since, ang, kasi ang traditional online payments are owned by organizations. Cryptocurrency is not owned by anyone. Wala itong middleman and wala itong organization. So, if you're still interested, then continue watching. So, ang crypto ay permissionless. Ito, wala po yung pigil sa'yo na gumamit ng crypto. Unlike banks na pwede silang mag, um, mag freeze ng account or pwede rin silang mag-prevent ng um, transaction. It is also censorship resistant since the way they designed the network, impossible siyang ma-shutdown. And it's the cheap and fast method of payment since like within 15 minutes na sa'yo na yung cryptocurrency. Ang isang famous na cryptocurrency is Bitcoin. And I believe ito yung kauna-unahang crypto. Ang nag-invent nito is si Satoshi Nakamoto. Ngayon, si Satoshi Nakamoto, walang nakakalam ko sino siya. It's either he's a single person or group of programmers. <laughs> Merong iba't ibang uri din ng cryptocurrencies like Ethereum, Cardano, Dot, Sushi, Dia, and many others. Makikita mo ang list of um, coins under coinmarket.com and I will just provide the link down below. Um, usually, ang tinitrade is from top 1 to top 20 kind of coin. So, ano naman ang blockchain technology? It's kind of overwhelming kasi dun sa words, diba? But blockchain is just a database of the coin. So, it's very very similar to Excel. Para din siyang spreadsheet. Pwedeng ma-change ang isang cell. Unlike Excel spreadsheet, hindi siya downloadable. Also, transparent yung blockchain. So, malalaman mo kung sinong may hawak ng mga coins. If really necessary, if you're really invested on kung sino talagang gusto mong malaman or kung sino talagang nag-hold ng, for example, nag-hold ng maraming bitcoins, malalaman mo since it's very transparent. But the fact is that hindi siya, hindi siya pwedeng ma-hack because the block is linked to one another. So, once may nag-hack, uh, mag-change lahat ng data in the in the spreadsheet. So, impossible talagang mahak siya. So, to trade cryptocurrency, you have to have a cryptocurrency. So, it means to say na sa isang coin, you need to you need to trade another coin with it. So, for example, if you're going to buy Bitcoin, 
you have to trade Ethereum to buy Bitcoin or vice versa. Something ganun. If you're trading Bitcoin, you get the smallest unit of a Bitcoin which are called Satoshis. The platform I use is Binance.com. It's an international brokerage platform na I do trust. I will um, also post the link down below. It's a Pilipinas, there is an app called coins.ph where you can also trade um, cryptocurrency but tatlo lang ang cryptocurrency na nandun, which is Bitcoin, Ethereum, and XRP. Pero dito sa platform na Binance.com, you can trade any coin. And also, yung ano kasi, yung transaction fee when you trade Bitcoin via coins.ph medyo May kamahalan siya. So, what I do is, I deposit from coins.ph to binance.com. If you want to know more about how I deposit funds from coins.ph to binance.com, please do comment down below and um, gagawa tayo ng isang video about how to deposit and how to withdraw. So, balik tayo sa pagtitrade ng cryptocurrency. And the reason why I like the platform very much is because ang cryptocurrency market is open 24-7. So, hindi siya nagpapahinga. It's just there. So, whenever you want to trade, you can just trade. Not unlike the stock market has some um, market timings as well as forex and other commodities as well. For trading purposes kasi, you have to learn how to read a chart. Ang chart kasi is a way of um analyzing the past prices para malaman or may predict yung next price niya for your trade. You can speculate using indicators to know when the price will go up or down. So this is really golden guys because if you know how to analyze chart, if you know how to read a chart, you would know how to trade on stocks on forex and other commodities so i made this channel to help others learn on how to read charts as well i've been studying about this and i have paid seminars and this will be all free learning for you all you have to do is subscribe to this channel and click the like button if you want to learn more and also please comment down below if you have other suggestions or if you have like uh, recommendations for the next uh, videos this will all be going to be about trading about analyzing charts i hope that i could spread this information this free learning for everyone unlike me i have to pay for seminars just to learn all of this this channel is actually all about uh, reading analyzing charts uh, from an absolute beginner I've decided to start this with cryptocurrency and probably we can also move on for stock market and commodities as well and also this channel is all about technical analysis and as always in trading um, exchanges um, there is a saying called Dior do your own research then only invest money in which you can afford to lose but then i don't believe in that kind of saying because who wants to lose their money right kaya makikita nyo that there are also losses but there are more wins um hindi lang puro panalo dito um so i advise you to do your own research be wise try to analyze and learn and study first before venturing into this kind of business but if you learn the tactics na you can actually grow your money um you can use this in instrument as your passive income so maganda rin naman na kahit na nasa bahay tayo meron din natututunan at nagalaw din yung pera natin for this kind of investment hindi lang siya natutulog sa bank so please to join me in this then we will talk more about trading we will talk about how to um how to trade on binance.com we will talk about what kind of trader are you and also other indicators that you can learn so please do share also to your friends or family about what this channel is all about i do hope that everyone is going to be profitable on this type of learning and we'll see you again soon bye
we will analyze on how to read candlesticks these are the candlesticks what green means what red means